All right, so we're doing a video here about uh, what to do when we're going a plane. A lot of times folks forget this from their training. Um, but a couple quick things. One, I always, always want to make sure I have enough depth. My first way through, I'm going to do this incorrectly. I actually have my trim up, which I do not want to have my trim up when I'm going to plane. I'm going to show you why. And I also don't want to always proceed to plane slowly. A lot of folks do that. I am going to go to planes. Hopefully everybody's going to hold on here. But I'm going to proceed kind of slowly as I go to plane. Now, hopefully we'll see this in the video about the bow rise that I'm going to get. You see that bow rising up where I start to lose the horizon and I can't even see. And the boat's leaning back a whole bunch. It feels rather uncomfortable. And I can try to throttle my way up, but I don't think it's gonna make it. I can't get the bow to come down. So that is not the way to go to plane. I'm gonna bring that bow back down. I'm gonna do it the correct way now. I'm gonna put my trim all the way down. Just ran my trim all the way down. I still have enough depth. I'm in 15 feet of water. And this time when I go to plane, I'm going to go a little more aggressively on that throttle. So it pushes the boat in, up, and onto plane. And let's see the difference in that bow rise. I'm accelerating a little more aggressively right now. And you'll notice the bow didn't rise. And now we're getting up to our about 20 miles an hour in a second here. There is 16, 18. And now I'm actually planed off. You'll see how level the boat runs. I have a great field of vision. I'm on plane 18 miles an hour. And that's how we do it. Trim all the way down, up on the plane. I'll come off plane now just to remind you that, again, when I'm going to plane, I want to make sure I have a sufficient amount of depth. I want to make sure that my trim is all the way down. And I want to have a smooth but aggressive throttle response. Get that boat up on the plane, which is a lot easier to drive. So hopefully that helps you next time you're out in the water to get on the plane. Thanks for watching.